Hey everybody, I really appreciated all of the kind words and prayers um, from the last video about the whole farm accident. Um, I Trust me, I'm not going to beat myself up for it forever. Um, it was my mistake, 100%, um, but I will always feel bad about putting my dad and Jeff in that situation. But I did go see the surgeon today, so I thought that I would um, give a little update. I know a lot of people are asking. Every single doctor, nurse practitioner, physician's assistant, nurse, radiologist, x-ray tech, every single one that I've seen in the last five days has looked at the x-ray of my foot and said, yep, you, you're gonna need surgery. And then that's why I obviously had the appointment with the surgeon today. Um, so I went in there I've just been praying the last five days that um, the surgery wouldn't be as complicated or as bad as like, you know, um, the worst case scenario or anything. And I was praying that it would be a quick recovery from the surgery because I've never had surgery besides like my tonsils and that doesn't really count. I feel like that was a long time ago and it's not that bad. Anyway, um, so I went in there Got it all checked out um, at Ortho Indy. They were absolutely wonderful, genuinely. I had the best experience with them um, at the Fisher's location on Friday. Um, I was at their main location today. Genuinely, every single person I met there was so helpful and kind and just a genuinely good person. And I truly, I appreciate that um, in a place like that, especially because like, I feel like most people going in there are probably already stressed out, but anyway best news ever um he does not think that i will have to have surgery um so i am so grateful i wasn't even praying for that um i was just praying for the surgery to be relatively simple and um a quick recovery so i'm over the moon i go back in three weeks um just to get everything checked out again and x-rayed to make sure that it's on the right track um and that so surgery still could possibly be an option um but as of right now, he, he had very high hopes that I would actually heal quicker and do better without the surgery since um, it would just be the one bone um, and neither the bones on either side of it were like broken, like in a parallel. So um, since it was just that one, he said that I'd be better off probably without it. So I'm in this boot. Actually, I'll show you what my legs look like right now. So this is the boot we got. Um, I'm just gonna spend the next uh, six weeks picking chaff out of it, you know. Um, so we got a new walking boot and I'll use the other one to sleep in. I still can't put weight on it for three weeks, but the rest of my legs are still really swollen. Um, my knees especially, they still hurt pretty bad, but Overall though, I feel like I'm doing pretty well. Um, I'm doing a lot better like pain-wise in my knees. As long as I'm moving and they don't stiffen up, I'm good. Um, the surgeon said that I no longer have to sleep with my legs elevated, which will really help my sleep because I really haven't slept in five days. Um, and what was the other thing? Oh, he did give me the all clear. He said that I didn't really seem like a person when I asked about how much I could do that would listen to him anyway if he told me I couldn't do anything so he said as long as I was careful I could and wasn't putting weight on that foot I could do anything I wanted around the farm very grateful for that but he did request that I continue to take it easy like I have been the rest of the past like four or five days um for the next few days um and catch up on sleep he said you know that's the main thing so yeah um really really great report overall and check this out the neighbor just let me borrow his little scooter thing i'm already having too much fun with that um it's pretty sweet actually but i am so grateful for all the neighbors who have like given me ice machines there's so many that have like offered the same things like i think i was offered three of the, like the continuous icing machines um and just so many wonderful people. So I'm, I'm counting myself just extra lucky and thanking God. God is so good, really. But thank you guys again for all of your prayers, well wishes, good vibes. 
whatever is your jam, thank you for sending them my way.